Hi and welcome back for another tutorial on setting up your Bob PMS account. In this video we will be talking about meals. If your hotel provides food to your guests, you can set up the meal software. However, if you offer only a breakfast and it is always included in the prices, you don't need to set them up. When selected in the booking, meals help for the easier choice of a suitable rate. Now let's see how to set them up. From the main menu, select Other Settings Meal. Click on New. Enter the name of the meal. In the Order field, arrange the meals as they happen chronologically throughout the day. For example, for breakfast enter 1, for lunch enter 2, for dinner enter 3. Click on First Meal for the first meal guests will have on the day of their arrival. Usually it is the dinner. By this field it is determined which meals to be included in the report for the day of arrival and which ones to be in the report for the day of departure. The meal marked to be the first one and these having a greater order number will be included for the day of arrival and the ones having a lesser order number for the day of departure. Choose if a meal is standard or not. Click on create. After choosing the meals when a new booking is created, the rates in the rate field will be rearranged. For your convenience, the rates corresponding to the chosen room type and the selected meals will be separately specified in the match booking. All of the rest of the rates will be in the section Other. Code PMS offers also management of somewhat non-standard meals. The meal report gives information on the meals offered by you or by, by partners of yours as an exception. Such meals, for example, are the lunch packet provided to guests during excursions or the meals at restaurants outside the hotel in similar situations. You may mark such meals as non-standard by unchecking the standard checkbox. In order to mark that a given booking is with non-standard meals, open the booking and click on the Edit button in the section Meal. Add non-standard meal date. Fill in the date, tick the checkbox of no the non-standard meal and enter the number of adults and children. As the parameter defined is valid for the whole day, it is necessary to also mark the standard meals for this day, if any. In the same section, you can also change the first meal for a certain booking. It will rearrange the meals for the date of arrival and departure only for the meal report concerning the given booking. If your hotel has multiple eating areas in the booking, you can also choose in which of your restaurants the guests under the, this booking will dine. Through this section, the meal report will provide you with more detailed information for planning purposes. Code PMS provides you with the detailed information about meals. You can run the meal report for a certain period, providing individual information for each day. In order to have accurate information for planning purposes, the number of adults and children is to be entered in each booking. With this, the meals are all set. Now you can add them to the respective rates and the system will automatically charge them. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more tips and tricks in Quote PMS.